Welcome to Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by and of course you got here just in time. That's right, I'm camping at Martin Dyes Jr. State Park. We're gonna tour the hen house unit. This there will actually be several videos for Martin Dyes Jr. State Park because the dang standing in fire ants. Hate when that happens. Hate when that happens. All right, so there's going to be a couple of two videos at least for this state park because it's it's divided with a highway in the middle and and it's pretty big, so the videos would be really long. So this is video one of at least two. So let me swap out and get my gear on, and we'll go see some stuff. If you're on the 360, bear with me. I gotta swap a battery. Go see some stuff. So I was here at Martin Dyes Junior State Park five years ago. A little, little different time of the year. Such a beautiful park. This, this is one of my top five will always be in one of my top five state parks. It's just uh, so beautiful. We're in the big thicket of Texas. Lots of rainfall in this part of Texas. There's actually more annual rainfall here than the Pacific Northwest. So therefore we have a lot of swamp type Terrain. Lots of mosquitoes, alligators, all that stuff you really want to experience when you're camping. Especially the alligators. dark skies at night there's no, hardly any light pollution Thing and a bad thing at Martin Dyes Junior State Park. You've 
we've got centrally located dumpsters. They're, they're not uh, convenient to we'll go down here first. These are some pull-through sites. This is a loop. We're going to find out. dead end. There's two sides to the park. The park's divided by State Highway. We're currently on the south side. Cannot go wrong with any of these screen shelters. Here's the end of the road. small pull through
That's a big one. for work. Fishing dock for your fishing pleasure. Make sure you bring plenty of deep. Mosquitoes are horrendous. But they do provide you with firewood uh, for a donation. Dollar a stick. is the loop I stayed in on my previous visit. I had a really awesome waterside campsite. Guess what we're gonna do? Guess what? We're breaking the law, breaking the law. That 
was the site that I was in. Site number 215, I think. Yep. There are almost 600 sites, maybe more than that. There's a lot of campsites here. Oh no, we're going the wrong way! I think I've refinished this road since I was here last. be happy to know this lake is not low there's actually water at the end of the boat ramp it's not a very deep lake this is B.A. Stinningham Lake B.A. Stinningham it's about eight feet deep overall so during the summer it's pretty warm This park does not get a lot of camper activity during the summer because of that. But during the winter, this is a snowbird park. We have a bunch of primitive tent sites. to the end of this tour. the alligators this is where you would do it excellent view of Lake B.A. Stinningham. What a beautiful park. One of my always, always in when I'm doing hold on 
when I'm doing ratings on parks and rankings, be it uh, Martin Dyes Jr. State Park is always in the top five. I, I just really love this campground. I hope you enjoyed this little tour of the Hen House unit at Martin Dyes Jr. State Park. Stay tuned. Tomorrow, there will... Okay, so if you're on the Insta360, it'll be a couple days before the next one is queued up. If you're on the GoPro footage, then you'll have another, the other side of the park tomorrow or the next day. Anyway, it'll be soon. So, but your next scooter run is going to be the other side of, of Martin Dyes Jr. State Park. So if you're still with me at this point, thank you so much. If you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. That really helps with that YouTube algorithm thing. If you've already been following along, I cannot say it enough. Thank you. I know your time is valuable, and I appreciate you spending some of it watching my videos. Thank you for that. The fire ants are eating my feet up again. All right. What, where am I? I'm lost. I forgot what I was saying. Okay, for my patrons, your generosity is most appreciated. Thank you. It really helps. You guys rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?